Yo, what is up, Mink Superstars? Here we are back with another video of Nintendo Direct. This is gonna be my very first video of reacting to Nintendo Direct. I did it before with uh, Xenoblade Chronicles 3 um, Direct kind of thing, but uh, never really did I direct, so this will be the first. One thing is definitely uh, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild is the sequel. Maybe Fire Emblem DLC or uh, what I'm looking for is, you know, I really don't know. There's a lot to really expect expect in um, Nintendo Direct. Okay, we're starting off with this game. A thousand years ago. Our lands endured a vicious war with the fell dragon. This looked like a whole new game. To aid us, heroes known as emblems. Oh, it's them, okay. It's <laughs> Fire Emblem. It's going to be a whole new game of Fire Emblem. We were victorious in defeating and imprisoning the fell dragon. In the years since, our world has been safe. But now, I sense a resurrection. The binding weakens. Hey, what happened? What is this? The binding oh, okay. Weakens. I hope that doesn't happen again. Oh, is this our new protagonist? Ooh, look at that hair. Yo, this doesn't look bad. This actually looks pretty good. Oh, it's going to be a lot of new characters. Oh, it's Marth. Can't forget our boy from Smash. Fire Emblem Engage. Awake. Wait, this man been sleeping for a thousand years? Okay. Wow, they really improved with uh, of how they're gonna show the action. So you have to like get rings to use the the power of these characters. That's actually pretty cool. Another act. Right, and you can customize. Okay. Oh, are they interlinking like Xenoblade? That's where they combine together. Yo, that's actually pretty cool. Yo, I like this. Is this game gonna come out December? She asked me to gather all of the rings and bring peace back to Elios. Fire Emblem engaged. January 2020, 2023. That's a great start. Yoshiaki Koizumi, and I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. All right, let's get right into it then. What you just saw was the latest installment of the Fire Emblem series. Oh, I can definitely see that. In addition to the standard version, we'll also be releasing the Fire Emblem Engage oh. Divine Edition, containing collectible items. They're so cool to have, but I just never really got the chance to get any of them. You know, it costs a lot of money, you know. Let's take a look at our first batch of headlines. All right. The forbidden story begins. Oh, this is the one I saw in Smash. Well, she was a spirit. Dang, fatal frame. Okay, why do I have the subtitles on? This is actually annoying. Okay, there we go. That's better. In search of her lost memories. 
Oh, it's a horror, scary game, huh? I might actually give this game a try. Use the camera obscura to repel evil spirits and uncover the memories that were sealed away. A dark curse looms near. What ancient rituals will be revealed? Fatal Frame, Mask of the Lunar Eclipse launches for the first time in the West on Nintendo Switch next year. Oh, I am. I'm definitely gonna try out that There's game. A new hero who looks. Oh yeah, Xenoblade Chronicles 3 DLC. Introducing Wave 2 of the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 expansion pass for the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 game. This is Eno, a new hero. She appears to be, uh, mechanical? <laughs> Whoa, she's drinking the whole ether cylinder? Your party. Expanding your options for classes and battle strategies. Yo, this is good. Oh yeah, the challenges. I think you get new clothes every time you win a battle and challenges. I'm pretty sure you get new clothes. To earn rewards. Challenge even stronger enemies to earn valuable accessories and <laughs> yeah, as I thought, they all got some nice swimming <laughs> swimming wear. More hero and gameplay additions will arrive in wave three. Oh, another new hero in DLC 3. Can't wait. Another Square Enix game? What they got in store for us? I really love the triangle strategy. What is this? Is this like another Octopath Trap? As soon as I said it. Oh, it's a 2! Octopath Traveler 2! Oh, another big adventure. Through the land of Celestia. With that, we could realize a world without conflict, without bloodshed. I'm going to become a star and bring smiles to people's faces, just like Mama. I'm hitting the road. I'll be back once I eliminate that devil called poverty from the world. Wow, this is gonna be a good game too. Just looking at this game reminds me of Triangle Strategy. Yep, that's gonna be a big adventure. Oh, really? That's going to be a little difficult to grind if you're gonna take this game to a whole nother level and what adventures await them in this new world think I found a source love, huh? the eight travelers each have their own story to tell where will their journeys lead them and you that's gonna be a crazy adventure with all of us Octopath Traveler 2 launches on Nintendo Switch February 24, 2023. I don't know why I had to set the date when he was saying when it's gonna be released. Please look forward to the journeys of eight new heroes. All right, can't wait, can't wait. Let's see some more headlines. All right, let's get to it. Oh, Mario and Rabbit Sparks of Hope. Can't forget about that game. That game is gonna hype me up. Let's dive into exploration. Freely roam through all sorts of wondrous worlds, each one jam-packed with discoveries. <laughs> Can't wait to explore those areas, man. Find coins. Unlock hidden paths. Who's the what what who is the rabbit with the green and black hair? They got some DJ in the house. You can get items that'll come in handy during battles. After each quest or battle, yep. your team will earn rewards and get stronger. Sparks are here to lend a helping hand. Recruit up to 30 different sparks, each Dang. with their own special powers and skills. They can help spark a decisive victory. I see what you did there, spark some things up, huh? Can Mario and the rabbits put an end to the darkness? Of course. Mario Plus Rabbit Sparks of Hope launches on Nintendo Switch October 20th. 
Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. A gold edition can also be pre-ordered, containing the Oh, is this the digital edition or something? Season pass. Season pass? Oh, I was gonna see what happened there. Here's a sneak peek. Mario Kart? What? Mary Mountain from Mario Kart Tour. Mario Kart Tour, huh? They got some good maps. I ain't gonna lie. Oh! No way! Peach Gardens? Oh man, I just been hit by a hard nostalgia of this. Oh, I remember playing that a lot when I was little. Wave three of the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Booster Course Pass DLC for the Mario Kart 8 Deluxe game launches this holiday. Wow, can't wait. Active Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack members can enjoy this DLC at no additional cost. That is going to be, be purchased on its own. fun to do. How was that? Very good, man. Next, we have some news to share about Nintendo Switch Sports. Oh, he has the golf, right? Yep. In the next free update, golf will be added. There we go. There's some golf. I still play Switch Sports, but I might play again course, as soon as golf gets local. comes out. Additionally, up to eight players online can play at the same time on the same course in survival golf. It's a survival goal. Will be out. We previously announced that the update would release this fall. However, we'd like a bit more time for development, so the update is now planned for this holiday. Okay, now to the main event. Please take a look at this. What? Another is it a Pikmin game or something? You show a whole mobile game of Pikmin like Pokemon Go. This is this is Pikmin 4. I knew they ain't gonna do us like that. Pikmin 4. Let's go. Can you survive uh. the season of death? Oh, Harvestella. When I saw the first trailer, this game got me, you know, like I want to play this game, you know. This is going to be a fun game to do. While facing numerous dangers, you'll begin to uncover the truth of this ill-fated world. Well, we gotta change that. This presentation, a demo containing the opening days of your farm's first season, will be available on Nintendo eShop. Oh, I might try that out actually. To the full game once purchased. Harvestella launches on Nintendo Switch November 4. November 4. All right. Get ready. Oh, you almost forgot Bayonetta 3. Oh my. After 500 years. Umbra Witch Bayonetta was revived in the present day. In the first Bayonetta game, she clashed with angels to recover her lost memories. Yeah, that's what happened. And in the second, confronted demons to save her best friend. Oh yeah, I still third one. She's saving the whole now, world now. Third installment, she'll fight to protect the world from the sudden <laughs> invasion. Of saving the world. Yep. for herself to fighting for others to fighting for the world <laughs> those who have overcome their past history that's crazy to fight alongside her include the journalist Luca look at this guy Umbra witch Jean new ally Viola also joins in on the action a hair raising <laughs> who's that guy <laughs> Trotting adventure awaits in Bayonetta 3, launching on Nintendo Switch October 28th. Oh, bring it on! Are available now on Nintendo eShop. After today's Nintendo Direct, a new trailer delving more into gameplay will launch on our official YouTube channel. Hmm, I'm gonna take a chance to see that too. Then Kirby, this 
What is this? Return to Dreamland Deluxe is coming to Nintendo Switch. Wow, okay. One day, Got my interest. Crash lands on Planet Popstar. To help Magalore return to his home planet, Kirby and his friends set off on an adventure. <laughs> his friends with Meta Knight and King DDD. You call them friends with Kirby? Okay. The new mecha copy ability makes its debut. Blast foes from a distance or punch them up close. Huh. That'll be fun. Other powerful moves as well. The game supports local play for up to four players on the same system. Plus, everyone can play as Kirby while using their favorite copy abilities. <laughs> There's also That's amazing. There's sub games to play. This includes the new sub game Magalore's Tome Trackers and returning ones like Samurai Kirby. <laughs> All sub games That's cool. That's very cool. Players. This look like Mario Party mini games. Of deluxe proportions awaits. Man, bring out the Kirby big sword. Return to Dreamland Deluxe launches on the Nintendo Switch system February 24th, 2023. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Good game. Good game. As part of Kirby's 30th anniversary. Dang, it's already 30th anniversary? Wow. That's cool. That's very cool. We hope you're looking forward to this game. Thank you for watching today's Nintendo. Hey, 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 there better be one more game, my guy. This next trailer will be our last announcement. <laughs> they always do that. What is this going to be? Super Smash Bros. 2? <laughs> Another continuation of the wave of DLC characters for Super Smash Bros. No, there's Legend of Zelda. This is the sequel. We're finally getting another trailer. Yeah, as you can see, those are Boko Blends and Moblins. What is that? Wait, that looks like... Looks like it's sacrificing. Ah oh, yes, Link, open that door. You are back. You are back, my guy. Run to the open field. Oh, okay, just jump. What is this guy? Jumping like in Fortnite? Oh, yeah, I almost forgot he has that ability now. Oh, what is that? What is that? The Legend of Zelda. Oh, the new name is going to show up. Tears of the Kingdom. That is very cool. <laughs> I'm actually getting tears. <laughs> I'm actually getting tears. Oh, man. Oh, it gives a release date. May 12, 2023. Amazing. That is very cool. <laughs> well, that is... What, what am I supposed to say? This is like my kind of reaction of the Nintendo Direct. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed uh, today's Nintendo Direct. I, I tell you that I enjoyed it. I liked it very much. So anyways, hope you made super star enjoyed today's video. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. And you guys know how it is. This Azure Z is out.